Don't blink at your boy, Yank. Welcome to the Villa Cotton Show. This is doing well on this 23rd of August, 2024. Uh, it is currently 7 o'clock. We had the beautiful sunrise. We have a couple of videos to film. We just came back from a nature corn. So we did a, a, an, an hour and a half, which is pretty good. Um, push come to shove, right? It's really freaking good. Uh, today, the subject is kind of cool. I was talking about there's going to be some big changes to the channel the um, of September, right? Which is... Was today with the turn twenty third? Um, there is a thirty first of August, so that means um, like a little bit more than a week, right? I'm not good at math, but that seems about right. Um, big changes are coming uh, to the channel, and of course, when you talk about changes, it's sorry about that. It's always going to be scary, right? I think changes is scary. And I was looking at the old school YouTuber because I'm lucky enough to make content. Uh, having people that made content before me so I'm lucky enough to have a blueprint of what trying of what we're trying to accomplish and um, when I look at old youtuber I'm seeing that are successful still relevant to this day because it's easy to be successful back then but to still be relevant I don't think it's as easy so you're seeing like DSP people like uh, uh, Boogie people like ADP um, people like Prank vs. Um, Prank vs. Prank Boyfriend vs. Girlfriend we're seeing Ron, uh, Roman Atwood we're seeing um, Fousey it, it's very hard to stay relevant right and, and one person it, the people that have made it relevant are people like PewDiePie Markiplier um, like such guys and I feel bad for those people not PewDiePie it's not necessarily because right now he's doing something different he's doing this uh, that uh, he's doing this dad stuff, which is phenomenal. This vlog stuff, this real life stuff, which is absolutely incredible. Um, but if you look at people like Mark Plyer or people like Jack Fed Guy, which I've been making gaming content for close to 20, uh, not 20 years, but I would say 16 years. Dude, I got a mosquito bite right on my left nut, and uh, it's itchy AF. Um, not sure how I got it because I had to be naked for that uh, on the balcony. But hey, uh, who knows what happened on a Monday morning. Um, so one of the person that is a genius to me is Casey Neistat. Casey Neistat, why is he a genius to me? Well, Casey Neistat was one of the OG YouTubers. Uh, Casey Neistat who did the vlog. The way his content, first of all, the way his content is made is phenomenal. I'm a big fan of his work. The fact that it seems so chaotic, yet so functional. The fact that he's, he's building stuff to put, the fact that he's building stuff to put in a video, the fact that he's, he's picturing or drawing at least. Um, the perception, the perception made for this video, I think Casey Neistat is, without a doubt, one of my favorite YouTuber. Um, and why I think he's a genius is because Casey Neistat was one of the OG, but Casey Neistat also did vlog content. Vlog content is less of a prison. So in my case, right, I don't want to be the guy known. Um, and it sounds weird because I'm wearing a fucking Attack on Titan t-shirt. Um, but I don't want to be the guy known for, for anime. I don't want to be the guy known to do food review. I don't want to be the guy known uh, for having puppy neighbors. Puppy neighbors. Can you guys see puppies? Hi, puppy neighbors. No, the balcony is a mess. Okay. Um. Oh, by the way, by the way, by the by the by the by. Ugh, I don't think you can have enough life to show it. Um, light to show it. Um. But yeah. So long story short, it, it is a a, a blessing. Uh. That so far I've been doing a lot of uh different content diversified content and the goal would be to diversify, diversify this content um see casey with by doing vlogs he was able to do years and years and years and years well it's sounding too repetitive he was able to do years and years and years where it's like hey you know what I can do whatever I want today. This is a song. My day this is a day to day basic. If I was to play a game, trust me, I'm a gamer, I'm thirty one years old. There's time where I don't like gaming anymore. As I mentioned one of the one of the most famous which was um prank versus girlfriend, right? Prank versus girlfriend, they had to do pranks to each other. Um and the prank had to rise up because you always want more. Because they went too far, that's how they break they broke up. If you look at OG YouTuber, for example, uh Kid Behind a Camera, um Kid Behind a Camera does still do vlogs. He did a 41 minutes vlog yesterday, which is kind of crazy cool. Uh, shout out to Kid Behind a Camera. But um, it's always going to be about, I don't know. It, it just feels weird, you know? It just feels completely weird. Anywho, uh, Casey Knight, that's the fucking genius. That's the video. But I love you. Uh, you know what? For the whole entire day, doesn't matter if I do 20 videos, doesn't matter if I do 30 videos, the entire day, the. Um, 
the the speech the speech I'm gonna have is uh, I'm back baby because we're back we're back to create content we're back to posting fuck the haters welcome in.